Hello guys, welcome to Iron. Today we're going to do a dungeon only available for three persons. That is this one over here, Teobomus Test Chamber. This dungeon is available on Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday. And the other days of the week is Adma. Monday, Wednesday and Friday, okay? Uh, so we are three persons and if you are a clary like me don't worry about it just go full DPS on it because this is what I do you don't need much heals uh, to do this you just need to kill quickly well if you have a cleric on the group that's always good but not like demand to have a cleric so we are going to do, we are two clerics and we have a sun weaver and we're going to do the quest, the, the dungeon and you have two quests while you are doing this, one of them is an event quest and the other one is uh, right here that you accept in the beginning of the, um, of the dungeon, okay? So let me just start since no one is starting. I'm going to just start uh, charging stigmas, okay? So, um, when you are doing dungeons like this one that you need to go just for DPS, it's okay for you to move your essence around or even your stigmas to put full DPS, stuff like that, okay? You don't need to go full heal. You need to do damage. In my case, I only change the... Um, the essence. I don't change the stigmas or anything. <laughs> ah, and this is available for doing the two times every six days. So make sure then when you do it, you do the full dungeon. You don't like waste time on the dungeon and then don't finish because I don't know maybe you can kill the boss or something like that okay okay so we are one person behind right it's okay so uh, we start here and you have to go all the way till here to kill the main boss of the quest that is the go to the mental lord laboratory eliminate this secret Ifrit, whatever her name is. Oh, he's already here, the, the healer. Normally, in every part of the room, you have a boss. Here, you have this big s kind of spider or something like that. And on the second one, that is always on the second one, even in Adma, you have a boss, a lady, lady boss, that uh, drops a special key. This key, uh, well, normally she drops, not always, but normally she drops it. And is to open the chest uh, after you kill the final boss. Oh crap. As you can see, you can just move around, especially if you have a team that can clear like very fast. Just move around, they will catch up. Okay, um, do you see her over there? It's 
so this is the lady boss that you have to kill on this part she is surrounded by mobs if you want you can just kill all the mobs that you find just for xp or something like that it's okay if you don't want to kill the mobs it doesn't make a difference for the final boss Oh, see, so a key and a magnet stone. Okay, so it doesn't matter who the hell uh, rolls the key, just make sure that at the end you use the key. Okay, because I already caught um, a dungeon where the guy had the key just left, he didn't care. That's not very good play. Okay, don't do that ever. You are like everyone is playing for the same, for drops, for XP. Um, you don't need to be a dirty player, okay? Well, if that guy that blocked me on because of AOA hear that, he, sh he probably would say karma. Well, <sighs> not my fault. The healer should have like a base um, armor, like the um, like a tank, you know. <laughs> should be so much easier because we get so fucked on the dungeons. Not this one is not doesn't matter, but in the other ones we get a lot of focus from the bosses and all that. It's very bad. Ugh. Okay, so this is the road, uh, the, the door for the boss. Okay, I got the key. So here you have um, four like teleportations of the elementals, and uh, more or less in halfway to killing the boss. She's gonna summon her minions, okay? So it's going to appear elementals that you have to kill. In the middle appears the stones that you have to click on it to start calling the boss or something like that, okay? Um Nami? You coming? Okay, so this is like this. Kill the boss quickly, because if you don't kill it quickly, it's going to start to attack uh, like very bad, and you will die. In the beginning, her attacks are not a big deal. You can you don't take a lot of damage from it, and it's very easy. But if you don't kill her quickly, what's going to happen? She's going to start to give a lot of damage, like really a lot, and going to be complicated even if you have a cleric don't forget that the clerics that are here are full attack and they cannot heal you as fast as they could if they were like full the um, full the full heals uh, just one just one oh no there is one, another one over there wait okay there you go Okay, two appears, there is two more left. Wait. This focus is real. Just, I need to do a, like, AOA heal just to make sure that everyone holds it. Mm. 
I still remember when this dungeon was for six players and very very difficult. <laughs> Everything's so different. Okay, she's almost dead. Yay! Okay, so now you have to drop the boss and since you have the key me I have to open the, the all that so let me roll okay well I have to drop the boss there you go Okay, so sometimes when you drop the, uh, the box, it gives you like um, a dress or a handband or something like that. Um, it's nice, so if you guys um, don't have luck, that would be good. And it's not like n nothing very, very expensive, but well, if you don't have, it's always good to have. If you don't have like nothing of that the, the like a dress or something like that to make you pretty <laughs> so basically it's this um you can do it two times in a row uh in and after that it, it gets in cooldown and you have to do it um all over again okay you can i'm sorry it gets cooled down and you cannot do it for six days okay so that's it guys thanks for watching bye bye